This house looks like it's from another planet, and yet it sits perfectly in its natural environment. Not a single rock was blasted to build it, nor a single tree removed. That was important to Joël Lunard, who built his dream house in the Ardèche region of southern France with the help of his wife. Bonjour. Hello. So here you are at our house in Chapias. It took me 36 years to build, and now I'll show you around. Lunard planned his house down to the very last detail and was very careful to factor in the position of the sun at any time of day or year. The various pods were added to the construction over time. Our gestures are rounded. We don't make angular gestures, and this house mirrors that. It's much more pleasant to live in an environment with curves than to live in angular cubes. Luna came up with his own construction technique. The structure is made from iron mesh, like a sculpture. We take 10 millimeter thick iron rods, the thickness of a finger. When this frame is finished, we add thin mesh on the inside and then manually cover the frame and the mesh with concrete. This bay tree is over a hundred years old, and the swimming pool was quite simply built around it. The water flows back into the tank that supplies the water to the pool in the first place. Sustainability is part of the overall concept. The interior is largely open plan, and offers many comfortable niches for relaxing. When you draw up the plans for a pod house, it's as if you have an organogram of a house. The different rooms organize themselves around each other and are connected by openings rather than doors. We have very few doors inside, but we do have over 65 openings onto the outside because it's important to have good views, such as this one. When construction began in 1972, they had no electricity or running water. They had to organize everything themselves. Most of the furniture is integrated into the construction. There's little storage room, but plenty of space for dreaming. It's a house in which we only have the essentials, because there are too many things in most houses. As soon as there's an empty corner, it's filled up. We wanted to limit ourselves to the essentials. The most recent addition is the guest bathroom. Joël Lunal is seen as a specialist in iron mesh constructions and has even worked with renowned architects such as Italy's Renzo Piano. I wrote my first book in 1981. That was 33 years ago. Yet not a week goes by without someone calling to ask for advice. It's amazing that there are still people out there who are interested in this technique and who want to build houses using my book as a basis. Joël Lunard is a visionary who never gave up, but who put all his efforts into building the house of his dreams.